What's good, Dizzy family? Welcome back to our channel. Um, I'm gonna jump straight into it. I already know y'all probably know what we're about to be talking about. Y'all seen the shade room posted. Pray for my family. And um, uh, all right, y'all. So my mom was visiting. Guys, I'm really stuck between. Two. She go right there. This mom. It's all over TikTok, all the media sites, all the blogs. Let me first off by saying we are very sympathetic to the state that we live in, as in Florida, Tampa, Orlando, Fort Myers, Key West, whatever the case may be. Um, it's unfortunate that we were in this situation when it comes to this hurricane. We pray for all the families that have been a part of this. Basically, we're gonna go ahead and tell y'all side because I, I know y'all seen something that was on social media and y'all only seen bits and pieces. But before we do that, I know y'all never really see my mother on social media. Y'all never see her on YouTube or this side. This is my mom. Um, she was with us during this incident. And we're just gonna give you all a storyline of, of what's really going on. And um, just so y'all can kind of know more of an inside scoop. Y'all know the 24th of September, we had a gender reveal. That's where my mom, that's where my brother that's holding the camera. That's why all of our family was out here. My mom, decided that she wanted to extend her stay to spend more time with her son, which is me, my brother, and um, her grandkids. And we did not know that there was a hurricane approaching Florida. So with that being said, some of our family made it out of here. Some of our family did not make it out of here. My mom was the one and my brothers did not make it back out of Orlando. My mom lives in Atlanta, Georgia. So that's how the situation started in the first place. It says a hurricane on the way, so. It's time to go away. Did you enjoy yourself, mother? Yes, I did. Tell them what's about to happen now. What's on the way? Ooh, 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 ooh. It's about to blow down. First it was going down. Now it's blowing down. <laughs> why, why, why is it blowing down? It's a hurricane. What's her name, Anna? Huh? Daisy. It's the hurricane coming. <laughs> it's coming. So we're here. We're chilling. We're vibing. Um, as we're chilling in the house, we're buying grills. We're buying groceries, going to Sam's, doing all of this stuff because a category four or five hurricane is approaching. All right, y'all, so this is what we got so far. They talking about, man, you'd rather be safe than sorry. I got three cases of water. They're saying that the power is supposed to go out 100%. Got the tea lights so the food could be warm. Um, got the Pampers, charcoal, lighter fluid, Hawaiian rolls, cakes, power, wireless chargers. With that being said, where we live at, guys, where we live at, People come knock on the door, hey, can you take everything off your patio? Because the winds are gonna be extremely high. It's suggested that you all do not stay on the premises and evacuate because there's a lot of construction around. We don't want nobody's cars being damaged. We don't want anything to be damaged. All right guys, so just an update. Y'all know we live in Orlando. It's a category four. It's moving already. It just knocked on our door and told us to evacuate. So I'm getting everything to the car. Please pray for my family. So my mom and Desiree say, hey, I think that we should take the car somewhere else because if they're saying stuff could be damaged and there's winds and all this stuff flying around, it's best to do that. So my friend calls, yo, I got a place where you can put the car. My mom said, you know what? The news told me where I can put my car. Y'all go do that. We're going to y'all put y'all cars wherever y'all feel comfortable at. Cause she's not from here so she don't know or familiar with the place i'm talking about so my mom puts her car over there we put our car over here now we make it back home fast forward the storm is happening everything's it's flooded it's the winds are blowing we decided that we were going to evacuate but then you say you know what why would we evacuate to a lower surface where we stay at it's a higher surface so the only car that we have with the guy with us guys is our jeep the one that you've seen in the video there he is, coming to get me. Finally. That white Jeep with the big tires, that's the only car that we decided to keep because if we were stuck in flooded water, that would get us out of anything. So fast forward, the storm is over, right? My mom is like, hey, everything's going back to normal. It's a lot of damages around here. Let me please, Isaiah, go check on my car. So the video that you all seen that I'm about to play right now when my mom was with us, we were leaving where we were at. As y'all can see, I'm stuck in the water. And Isaiah's trying to come around and get me. We were leaving where we were at. My mom was currently with us. You see this video where I'm pulling up in a Jeep 
and Desiree's out there waiting on me to come because they did not, they, you've seen the sidewalk, of course they're not gonna stand in the most flooded area. You see the sidewalk where they're standing and I'm pulling up in a Jeep, my mom is with us. Where we're going at that time is to go get the cars. Guys, in that area, it wasn't the most flooded area. It's crazy, it was a lot of, you know, people that lived in our neighborhood, you know, like, damn, y'all got the Jeep, y'all able to move around, but in different areas, it was super, super flooded. That area wasn't too flooded, but it was not walkable. You know, she's pregnant and my mom does not have the best health as well. So fast forward, we are in the car, right? We get, I get them from the flooded water. My mom and Desiree, I don't want them as a man, I don't want them walking in no type of flooded water. We don't know what's under there. I'm not gonna sit here and act like it's goddamn it alligators. Lake water. It's, it's lake it's, water, it's, water because basically that flooded water was overflowing lake water from the neighborhood that we lived in. Right. So they finally get in the car. So that's why y'all see my mom in that video, right? As we get to where we're going, remember my car is parked somewhere else. My mom is parked somewhere else. My mom said, okay, let's go get the car. So we take my mom to the nearest home. It's, I think it was by the double tree where she said, let me out right here. She's going to try to walk to this parking garage and go pick up her car. So she's going to go try yes. to pick up her car. Yes. And so um, as she's going to go try to pick up her car, I said, all right, mom, let me back up with you because now she got her car. She don't need me. Give her the address back to me. That's that. So she calls us like 15, 20 minutes later, right? Isaiah, Isaiah. Listen, I can't get to the car because the area that y'all dropped me off on, as I walk behind the building, it's a whole body of water. So she proceeds to try to walk. And as she's walking, meanwhile, she doesn't know how deep the water is. In some areas, it looks this high, but in some areas, it's this high. She got caught in water that was this high and then automatically got yeah. this high. And I was stuck. So one, yes, I in that whole area, there was no power at all. Right? Mm -hmm. So y'all see like, oh, we're talking on social media or whatever like that. It was, no, it was, it was staticky. Mm -hmm. So I happened to just make a video on our platform. Just that's what we do. We're we're content creators. So as we go to try to, you know, say we're trying to find my mom and everything like that, we were really trying to find her. All right, y'all. So my mom was visiting from the gender reveal. She's at a hotel. We're trying to get to her, but it's currently super flooded. This is crazy, y'all. This Tyrese respond when you see this. We didn't say, Mom, go make a video and respond. We didn't say that. She's a grown woman. And I'm not going to speak for you. What was your outlook of it? Well, actually, um, yes, I am a 49-year-old woman. And I, no disrespect to the residents in Orlando. Our heart went out to everyone. But yes, y'all, I went to get my car. And when I stepped over to the next I thought it was a step. It was nothing but water. No, I did not proceed. I tried. And at that point, look, I didn't know what was underneath that water. Right. You so can't I went really left. Tell to you I went right. There. And that's why I was saying, I'm on this side. I'm on two sides. Guys, I'm really stuck between two bodies of water. Guys, it's this side and this side. So because when I was walking, there was grass and it was like water. Shh. But then it got up. So now I'm stuck. So what other thing for me to do is and try meanwhile, to reach out where we stayed at, it was not that bad. Let me tell y'all, it was not that bad where it we stayed flooded. at. It, it was flooded still. still, but it was not that bad. Where we went to go pick up the car where we thought was going to be okay was the bad part. Mm -hmm. She parked by Universal Studios and she mm -hmm. parked over there in that tourist area because that's where the free parking was at. In my area where I parked at, I had to pay to park. And she did not want to do that because the news dropped down some locations where the mayor or the governor had wiped, that, yeah. that wiped all the cost away. So fast forward, we're looking for her, right? And when we made the post, the reason she's not picking up the phone, meanwhile, I'm calling my dad, I'm calling my sister to try to reach out to her. Every time I call her, it's like, Tush, tush, tush. Isaiah, we can't, we can't never understand each other. When I'm sending the messages, it's non-delivered. I happen to make a TikTok post like, yo, I'm trying to find my mom. Just keeping it real. We content, we're going to post the good and the bad. Not go ahead and try to manipulate the situation that we're right. currently going. And we got kids. We got, it's, it's no reason for us to do such a thing. So meanwhile, we're still starting to look for her. Meanwhile, we're asking, there's only three types of people on the street. Not even police. It's not fire department. It's tow trucks and people who and do electric. So we're respect. asking tow truck people like, hey, how can we get to this parking garage? They can't go under there. One thing you got to know, with a Jeep, 
when you have a Jeep, the big tires can only handle, like it can get you in the water, in high water, but you have to have a funnel so your engine does not flood out. So when the water's over the Jeep this much, yeah, y'all saying these big old tires and everything like that, yes, that's what Desiree decided to get the Jeep for. So for moments like this, or to be able to go mudded and stuff like that, we did not know that it was going to be this bad. But for you all to sit here and say, oh yeah, y'all do anything for clout and this and this and this and that. You have to understand this is what we do for a living. So what we decided to show you all, it was not something that, you know, we wanted to take advantage of a situation. So let's fast forward, guys. So as we're still looking for her, somebody sends us a message or actually somebody sees her and says, oh, I just seen y'all video. I think I saw her over here. First of all, the reason she couldn't go into a hotel, everybody's like, why don't you just call? Why don't you go into a hotel? Because the hotels are not open. Mm -hmm. There's no hotel open. This current hotel is no not no, it's not no hotel it. where it's like, oh, welcome in. We're taking. No, the people that stay in there is staying there. There's, the, the doors is locked. The elevator is not working. No, nothing. Because we rolled through there. You ever walked across the marsh? When you walk across the marsh, you're walking in. What is marsh? Grass? Uh -huh. Grass, mud. Wherever it might, it appeared to be, and then it's something bigger than what it was. So that's how I got stuck right there. When I got right there, and it was shallow, but then when I kept on stepping, I'm like, oh, wow. I am really stuck. When I look to the left, when I look to the right, I'm like, mind you, his car is somewhere else. My car is somewhere else. We left so to we try to go never, get our car. Yeah, we and were I had to, together. I had to wait to points. go get my car. Had to wait to go get my car because when I dipped off, I had to turn around because she said, son, I'm stuck. So I never wound up getting my car until today because I was trying to make sure she was good. So fast forward during this whole time, there's pe I'm going to show you all these videos. It's people walking on the street going right. trying so to get through water. Universal and this guy's out here walking. No you want to hold? No shoes on. You okay? Hold on to the truck. Huh? You want to hold on to the truck? Yes. All right. Look, I'm going to pull the window up. Hold on to it. Jump yes, on it. Hold on. Okay. All right. Thank you so much. Hey. Where are we going? I'm going to pick up my car in the parking. Which parking? Right here. To the right? Yes. To oh, the right. Over there. So, y'all, we are currently helping him. Go to his car. Thank you. Thank You're you so welcome. much. No problem. So I pick, we pick up a man and have him hold on to the car, and we take him to his location where he's trying to get. We so were rescuing. We were people. helping people. Yes, we were. So at the same time, it's like y'all look at this one angle, create your own narrative, and that's what's going to happen in social media. I have no problem with that. So one girl helped us and was like, "Oh, I just seen your mom's video or something like that. I know this town very well. I think she's over here." So we hit the loop around, and at this time, she's not answering the phone or nothing. Ain't made no more videos or nothing. And we roll right up on her. Happen to roll right up on her. And guess what she's doing? Y'all see that next video when she's walking in the water. Oh, 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 stand up. Oh, the wind blowing. <laughs> Hold on, let me drive through. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> And y'all talking about her reaction. You can't tell a person how to react. Right. You know what I'm saying? She, at this point, she's happy. I didn't know what could have happened. She was out there for like five hours. Right. Yeah. <laughs> she, it's, it's, it wasn't raining outside. It wasn't anything. It's just so water. It's just a lot of water. water. And at that point, she, she just didn't. Ex I, I can't speak for her, but me and Desiree was just trying to stay calm. As being content creators, we try to document the good and the bad. Right. Not come up off. There's no reason for us to come up off something like this. No. At the end of the day, we're fine financially. We're good. My family's straight. You know what I'm saying? But what we try to do is express to you all on these social media outlets that we're humans too. Yeah, we we, we had no. We just had a, a whole gender reveal that's getting millions of views. Why not focus on that? But real life situations, we try to show you all real life because we don't try to. We try to give you all realistic content. Y'all look at this and y'all be like, oh, you look at all these other creators and oh yeah, they doing this, they living large. No, they not really living like that. Let's talk about the stuff that we really going through. So not to go in and out, it ain't even about that, guys. I just want to say this again. If you all feel any type of way, we, we apologize. apologize. That's we apologize. that's all we can do is give you all the best that we can give you all and be our authentic, true self. If you all don't believe it, we cannot force you all to believe it. Desiree is pregnant. We just had a gender reveal. My mom was out here. My brother's out here. Don't even really want to be out here. Stuck out here due to the storm. So 
you know, when all this came about, it's, 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 it happens. But just wanted to kind of speak on it, um, show y'all different clips of us actually helping people, people stuck, you know, and not doing it for the camera because it's not posted. You all are going to be the first to see it. It's just more so showing the whole process that we're not bigger than anybody else. We show our real life events and maybe, you know, cringe to some of you all, but it's not cringe to us. And that's all that matters. So we care about you all's opinion. It's best that we made this video. Um, the people who don't follow us, people who just come in and out and talk mess, God bless you. Thank you for stopping by. The people who genuinely watch us, um, you all know our character. You all been seeing the journeys, the trials and tribulations through court with my daughter, through argue, arguments with my dad, through situations with my brother, with trials and tribulations between me and Desiree. And um, it doesn't go unnoticed. This is just things that happen sometimes. People get it misconstrued. But we still love y'all at the end of the day and praying for Florida. Um, this city, we have not been living here long at all. We've been here since last October. It'll be, it'll be a year um, in, a, in a couple days. But um, yeah, it, it's, it's very unfortunate that you know the state of Florida is going through this, but it's just life. And we tried to give y'all a, 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 a more inside realistic look. Some people took it around with it, but it's okay. Back to, you know, what's going on. But I just don't want y'all to throw shade at my mom. She has a lot of, uh, she don't even do this. You know what I'm saying? She, this is not her cup of tea. Um, she just happened to make a video. And you know, I was reaching out. I was trying to get some help and wherever I can get signal in. I had to reach out to get my And to the ones that helped. Thank you. Thank you. Because right. you know who you are. It's people that's helped. It's people that actually reached out to us on um, what's at like all types of stuff. So, yeah, so thank, um, you. thank you all. We're gonna go ahead and close this video out once again. We do apologize for the people that may feel offended, and um, it, it was nothing intentional, nothing spiteful, nothing to try to come up on. Um, we're up in many different ways. We're blessed, and we try to help others, but just try to you know show you all another um, space in life. So, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Hope this helps some of you all, and. Um, See y'all on the next one. Peace.